Hey everybody, welcome back to another reaction video. This is Bucky Barnes Free. And I'm assuming this is a clip montage of a bunch of different things he's been in. But, uh, yeah, I'm not exactly sure what to expect. <laughs> All I know about Bucky Barnes is that, uh, well, he was with Captain America in the first Captain American movie. And then he fell off a train. And then... His mind got warped, and he became like an assassin after you said some words. Yeah, my understanding is very rudimentary. I'm not a huge Marvel fanboy. Um, honestly, I just kind of gave up on superhero movies after a while. I just I got drained, man. I got like worn out with superhero movies. If they would just slow down with those movies <laughs> like it was almost saturation the market was saturated in marvel movies for the longest time and now that it's been a couple of years and you know yeah we got like the disney plus uh shows and the um which one just came out the uh shang shang li or something like that um if they just slow down with that stuff and make it more meaningful and impactful, I would have been more into it. But it was literally just one after the other, after the other, after the other, after the other. And I just gave up. <laughs> I just gave up. I didn't see him in theater. Um, I saw him years afterwards. Um, I just watched Endgame the previous night uh, for the second time ever. First time I saw it was maybe a couple months ago. So it just, it just, it lost me. I was like, I'm okay, I'm done. <laughs> but it's been interesting to see these cuts and that it's almost, it's been long enough to the point where it's back to interesting for me. Um, I don't know. It's just, it's weird. That's how I kind of operate. If it's, if it's just saturating the market, I just get over it fast. <laughs> I certainly understand why people were so attached to these uh, movies and characters and actors. The actors seem great. All these clip montages seem incredible. Um, but as far as the movies went, I don't know, man. I just, I, I got over it fast. And now, you know, I'm assuming in a couple years down the road, I'll get, like, back into it when everybody's, like, over it. <laughs> That's just kind of how it works with me. I'll just be like, oh, yeah, that those movies are so good. I just I want to go on a marathon of it. It's almost kind of like, uh, it's almost like Lord of the Rings and, like, TV shows and stuff. I never watch it when they're fresh out the gate. I always watch it, like, years down the road. The only show that in recent memory that I didn't do that with was Game of Thrones. Game of Thrones I was on every week. Um, although I did join it fourth season, fifth season. I just binged all the way up to it, and I just watched it every week on HBO. Um, so, yeah, this one is Bucky Barnes Free. Like the video if you like it. Subscribe to the channel. Leave a recommendation down below if you have a recommendation. We are well on our way to 1,000 subscribers. Thank you, thank you, thank you for joining me on this. It has been fun, interesting. I hope you've enjoyed it as well. And let's go. James, I asked you a question. Are you still having nightmares? No. I'm boosting the volume. We've been doing this long enough that I can tell when you're lying. Oh, by the way, I have no idea why the video is so narrow. <laughs> it's like, I think the black bars have been removed in this video that I downloaded. So I don't know what happened there. It's just, it's just the movie and none of the black bars like below and above the video. You're a civilian now. With your history, the government needs to know that you're not gonna... It's a condition of your pardon. So tell me about your most recent nightmare. 
was fast, strong. Had a metal arm. I didn't have a nightmare. Sergeant Barnes. Bucky, no! Most of the intelligence community doesn't believe he exists. The ones that do call him the Winter Soldier. He's credited with over two dozen assassinations in the last 50 years. So he's a ghost story. Bucky? Who the hell is Bucky? Whoever he used to be, the guy he is now, I don't think he's the kind you saved. Oh my god, this just to, okay, to show you how plugged out or uh how tuned out I've been to this stuff. Um I didn't realize what movie this is from. I thought this was from like an upcoming movie or like <laughs> I thought this was from an upcoming movie or something I had just never seen before. I think this is clips from Captain America Winter Soldier. Pretty sure. I cannot believe. I was just like sitting here, like, "Oh, this looks good. This looks like a good movie. They should, this should come out with this. This is nice." <laughs> He's the kind you stop. Yes. I, I think I saw this movie once, and it obviously it didn't have that much of an impact on me. I don't know what happened. Yes. Yeah, Your name. He's James Buchanan Barnes. Shut up! Everything Hydra put inside me is still there. All you have to do is say the goddamn words. He's my friend. You're my mission. Обращение на Родину. Один. Грузовой вагон. Finish it. Gives them with you to the end of the line. What does she know? Musco, are Daifku Daiske Datano. He had a job with a consulting company, and, and uh, he was working abroad, and he was killed. The police said. I, I didn't see anything. Wrong place, wrong time, but I will never know what really happened to him. I am no longer the Winter Soldier. I am James Bucky Barnes. One day, you're gonna have to open up and understand that some any of people this, really way. do want to help you and that they can be trusted. You sure about this? This is all like new to me. I won't let you hurt anyone. I can't trust my own mind. This is new for me. I didn't have a moment to deal with anything, you know? I had a little... I am so lost right now. <laughs> I think I missed a movie. <laughs> when I tuned out, I think I just missed, like, oh, multiple movies. Oh, I don't know what's happening right now. And other than that, I just went from one fight to another for 90 years. Je l'amnier. Something is still in there. J'avoue. Why are you making such a big deal out of something that has nothing to do with you? Steve believed in you. He trusted you. He gave you that shield for a reason. That shield, that is, that is everything he stood for. That is his legacy. He gave you that shield and you threw it away like it was nothing. So sure. maybe he was wrong about you. And if he was wrong about you, then he was wrong about me. 
I don't know if I'm worth all this to you. Uh, this must be from that new show, right? When you did all those years. But you gotta make them feel better. You gotta go to them and be of service. Oh, it's like a uh, addict or whatever, right? You have to make amends with people you've harmed in the past. Great edit on that. Awesome edit. Okay, so... <laughs> most of that was from Winter Soldier. And then I'm assuming the end part was from that new show on Disney Plus, I want to say. Yeah, haven't seen the Disney Plus show, and I must have seen Winter Soldier maybe once. <laughs> I don't even know if I saw it all the way through, because a lot of that was just like no reaction. I was just watching it as if I hadn't seen it before completely. It was just nothingness to me. I was just soaking it in. I was just like, what's happening? What's happening? <laughs> Oh my gosh. Oh, that's embarrassing. I was like, did I miss a full movie? What happened? <laughs> Thanks for the recommendation on that. Any <laughs> That was recommended by a viewer like you. And if you have a recommendation of something I either mentally forgot or I don't know what happened. That was so weird. <laughs> that was so strange. Uh, leave a recommendation down below in the comments. Like the video if you liked it. Subscribe to the channel. We are well within reach of a thousand subscribers, which is wild. Wild. Um, yeah, I enjoyed this. This was interesting. This was an interesting one. I was just like, what is happening? <laughs> oh, see ya.